this one occasion, I will get the door. <laughs> I think this is the amazing act we've been asking about. <gasps> oh, wow, it is! Yes! Come on in, guys! How exciting! Right, I think this is going to really wow Mac and Robert. Oh, Mac! Robert! What is it, sir? Look. Oh, I didn't know you had a clapper. Uh, we, we, we can't read the book now. Uh, well, you don't need to read the book. Just put that down there for a minute. That's it. But Off you go and prepare to be amazed. <laughs> yeah! All right! Woo. Woo. Oh, yeah! Woo. 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 Amazing, sir. Yeah. But um, come on, Mac. Oh, wait, wait, hang on a minute. Where are you going? Well, oh. to my workshop, sir. I mean, I, I know you mean well, and those jugglers—they—they they were amazing. But we just need a little bit of peace and quiet to finish our book. We won't be long, sir. I promise. Oh. Uh, <laughs> See you later, Justin. Amazing jugglers. <laughs> oh. Come on, Mac. Bye, Robert. Bye, Mac. Nobody wants to play with me. The what? Well, you're right. Look, little monster. Robert's left his book here. Oh, Robert, you've left your book? Yeah. Actually, I've got a really good idea. Why don't we hide Robert's book and then they can come out and play with us and look for it? Is that a good idea? Yeah. Right, little monster, you hide the book. I'll call for Robert and Mac. <laughs> oh, Robert, Mac. I feel so silly, I mean, honestly. Oh, it was back Well, I'm so sorry, sir. Oh, I seem to have left my book, but... Well, that's odd. I'm sure I left my book there. Well, that's very silly. I'm... My memory card must have become dislodged, honestly. I'm going to forget my own serial number now. <laughs> <laughs> um... <laughs> it's almost as if um, someone's hidden it. <clears throat> it's you, isn't it? You've hidden the book. Ah, well, uh, technically, <laughs> Little Monster hid it, didn't uh, she? Yeah! Oh! oh. Uh, now, little Monster, may I have my book back now? What do you think, Little Monster? We're never going to catch her. She's finished. Oh, but Robert, we had fantastic fun and games trying to find the book, didn't we, everyone? <laughs> well, sort of, but now I'll never find out what happens to Captain Rubles. Oh, dear. Well, what's so good about the book anyway, Robert? Oh, Justin, there is this rocket that's full of alien dinosaurs. Wow. No, 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 but wait. The rocket is heading straight for planet Earth. Oh, and only Captain Robot can stop them. With 
A sticky toffee pudding. Oh, a oh, sticky toffee pudding? We've got to find that book. I mean, what would Captain Robot do? He would probably just ask ever so nicely if he could have his book back, please. Oh, I say, he sounds very polite. Oh, oh, yes. Captain Robot always says please and thank you. He is a master of manners. <laughs> well, shall we try that, everyone? Yes! Yeah! Oh, all call for Little Monster after three. One, two, three! Little Monster! I wonder if Little Monster's got your book. Let's ask her very, very politely. After three, we'll all say please like this. Ready? We'll go, please. One, two, three. Yeah, that didn't work. Let's try it like this. <laughs> Ready? One, two, three. Oh, dear. Um, how about this, then? Please. How about that? Oh. Oh. That's lovely. A big cheer well for Little Monster. Thank you, thank you. At last we can find out how the story ends. Come on, Mac. No, no, but hang on. Hang whoa, on. whoa, oh, whoa, oh, whoa. Oh. Robert, oh, don't go into the workshop. We would like to find out how the story ends too, won't we, everyone? Really? Yes. Well, I suppose I could read it out loud. Oh, and even better, we could all act it out, couldn't we? Yeah. Oh, oh, let's do it, let's do it. All right, uh, I'll be Captain Robot. Right. I Okay. Here we go. There was no time to lose. Captain Robot put on his helmet. That's it. And boldly stepped out onto the moon. <gasps> but, oh no, he had forgotten to put on his moon boots. And now he was floating out into space. Uh... <laughs> Captain Robot. Uh, the alien dinosaurs laughed. <laughs> oh, excellent laughing alien dinosaurs and whooshed off in their alien dinosaur rocket. <laughs> now, Captain Robot grabbed onto the rocket. What? <laughs> me? That's the rocket over there. Sorry. Right. Not um, me. Um, but, but the uh, rocket was covered with alien dinosaur slime. Oh, not more slime. <laughs> Slipping, but quick as a flash, Captain Robot took out the extra sticky toffee pudding his mummy had put into his lunchbox and rubbed it onto his ham. Oh, great! That's, oh, well done, sir. Well done. Then, sticking to the rocket like glue, he gravely climbed along the speeding rocket, squeezed it through a tiny window that was conveniently left open, and safely steered the alien dinosaurs back to their own planet in time for tea. Woohoo! The end! Uh -huh. Well done, Captain Robot! Yay! That was fantastic. What a great story. I'm sorry for hiding your book. Oh, well, it was even more exciting sharing the story with all of our friends. Well, I've got one more thing I'd like to share with all of our friends. Well, what, sir? Well, a song and a dance, of course. Oh, righty. Come on, let's all be robots. It's the hokey go. You put your robo arm in. Your robo arm out. In, out, in, out. You shake it all about. You do the robo hokey and you turn.
let's have a huge cheer for our guests. We've got Max! Yay! Hey! Little Monster! Yay! And the biggest cheer of all for you! Yay! And we'll see you next time in... Yeah, When Justin got cream on his face. Our favourite bit was when Robert threw juice in Justin's face. You can carry on the fun on the CD website and... Animal Heist! <laughs>